Hello Linda, welcome or welcome back to my channel. I know, I know you guys must be wondering who the hell does she think she is? She vanishes from the face of YouTube for a good 10 plus months and I'm acting as if like nothing's happened. I completely understand in case if you guys are mad at me, but I think I'll talk more in detail on where I was exactly, what I was doing and why I was gone in a later sit down, get ready sort of a video. But Today I will be talking about the newly launched Maybelline Teddy Tints. It's all the rage right now. I see so many different bloggers talking and raving about it. So in case if you guys are wondering how this product performed on me and whether or not I would recommend it to you guys, then please continue watching. Let me quickly give you guys some more details about this product. So these are their Superstay Terry Tint. It retails for 749 rupees and it's meant to be used both on your lips and your cheeks as well. And in terms of the claim of this product, it's supposed to be up to 12 hour long wear. It's transfer proof, it's lightweight. But the thing that absolutely sold me on this product was the fact that it says that it's marshmallow bouncy elastomer lightweight matte texture and basically what it helps you achieve is those blurred lips so i have two different shades here with me the one that i picked up is 55 knee high and the other one is 15 skinny dip so one is more like a pinky mauvey kind of a shade and the other one definitely had to be like a nude shade you guys know I love my nudes so I love the shade range on these products I think it's super versatile and it's something that will work on a lot of different skin tones now if I talk about the packaging I absolutely love the packaging on these products it looks so cute and so adorable I absolutely love 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 it now when I bought this product I went in with an open mind because if I'm gonna be completely honest Maybelline Superstay lip products is something that I'm not really a huge fan of usually their superstay lip ranges are very you know sticky i find them very heavy although very long lasting i'm not gonna lie but it's not something that i would pick on a day-to-day -day basis out of the two shades that i picked up i absolutely love the shade 55 knee high now this is the kind of shade which is my lips but better this is the shade that i have on my lips right now i have it on a little bit more opaque but the beauty about this product is that you know you do get the control and the flexibility to give you either that you know very super blurred kind of look wherein you know it's just giving you a wash of color on your lips and makes your lips look super blurred which is the way that I personally like using this lip product or maybe in case if you want like a full opaque color then you can definitely build it up maybe two or three times depending on the kind of opacity that you need so this product is supposed to be multi-use which means it's supposed to be great for your lips and your cheeks as well and I saw a few people also using it on their eyes but I don't think so I like it anywhere else apart from my lips I tried using the shade skinny dip on my cheeks and as you guys can see from the clip I had such a horrible time blending the shade out on my cheeks sort of blends into nothingness but it makes your foundation or your base makeup you know look patchy in a way so I would not really recommend you guys using it on the cheeks I think one of the main reason why it didn't really work for my cheeks is because of the formulation of this product since it's so moussey and it's you know it's supposed to give you that blurred kind of look I think that's the reason why it didn't really work on the cheeks so when I first applied this product I obviously just applied it like a wash of color and I absolutely love that so when you initially apply this product it goes on super smooth I noticed that it did not cling to any dry patches that I had on my lips which is great but it takes forever and a half to dry it takes over good five to seven minutes to dry which is something that i don't want take it i mean that's the kind of patient that i don't have so the overall waiting for the lip product to dry experience was not really that great for me because the formulation is very weird on this where you know the initial formulation when you apply it it feels very lightweight not gonna lie but would you waiting while a phase hota hai na jab it's drying the longer it is on your lips you start feeling it on your lips but once it's completely dried then you don't feel it on your lips and that's only if you've applied one thin layer all over your lip if you go in with like multiple application it definitely feels very heavy on your lips and it's something that i don't really enjoy 
Another thing that I did not like about this product is that it is sticky. Again, अगर आप एक ही layer लगाते हो तो इतना sticky नहीं लगता But if in case अगर आपको वो opaque color चाहिए and when you go in with two to three different uh, you know layers, then it starts to get really sticky. Now if that stickiness bothers me or not, yes it does because who likes having sticky lips? Like I don't. But I have to give it to Maybelline that it's extremely long lasting. It will stay put throughout the day, no matter what you do. And by the end of the day, you definitely have to use either a bi-face makeup remover or maybe like a cleansing balm or a cleansing oil to actually get rid of this product. So the fact that, you know, it's extremely sticky, it takes forever to dry and it feels heavy on my lips. I don't think so it's, you know, worth spending your money on it. Definitely if it goes on sale, please go ahead and try it out. But if you're solely you know buying it because of the hype that it's been getting all over social media then i would say no don't do that don't waste your money don't be like me okay so if i have to summarize my overall thought about this product i would say that this is an okayish product you can easily skip this product and uh, you know be absolutely fine about it and in case if you want this product only because of the effect like that blurred look that it gives you can achieve that look with pretty much any liquid lipstick just dab a little bit of liquid lipstick on your lips and just use your fingers to blur out the liquid lipstick and you'll be fine you don't really have to invest in this to get that blurred effect you know okay so there you go guys that was my quick review on the newly launched Maybelline Superstay Teddy Tint I really hope that you guys liked watching this video liked watching this review and in case if you guys did then don't forget to like this video let me know in the comments down below if in case you guys have tried this product or not with that you guys i am gonna take a leave and i'm gonna see you guys in my next video bye linda